Kentucky's highest court is considering a lawsuit from the attorney general over spending cuts made by the governor. The Supreme Court heard arguments from attorneys representing the governor and the attorney general. The issue is the executive order trimming university budgets by more than 4 percent. WYMT's Phil Pendleton heard the arguments and has more from Frankfurt. On one side, the attorney general is stating that spending decisions need to be made by the legislature. On the other, the governor says that executive decisions are simply those decisions to spend taxpayers' dollars wisely. Colleges and universities were told to cut their spending by more than 4% last spring. The attorney general filed a lawsuit saying the governor's actions were illegal. He says the spending decisions are the responsibility of the legislature. Andy Bashir says numerous state statutes prohibit Bevin from doing what he did. It is solely about whether a governor can unilaterally reduce an appropriation by the General Assembly to our universities in a time of surplus. That answer is a resounding no. Obviously a difference of opinion uh, uh, between the attorney general and the governor's office about whether this commonwealth has a surplus or not. The justices heard arguments for nearly two hours this morning. If they do decide to rule for the attorney general, they will be reversing a decision made by the Franklin Circuit Court judge. In Frankfurt, Phil Pendleton, WKYT. Now it could take several weeks before the Supreme Court issues a ruling.